maybe you've seen that I'm now putting uh, videos that I reviews for freeware, but some of you may not know what freeware is. So, if you're asking what freeware is, this is the video for you. If you know what freeware is, and you can just go on and watch whatever reviews I may have out right now. And okay, so we're gonna start out with a quick definition of freeware, which is software that is provided without charge. Pretty simple, easy to understand. Software for your computer that's provided without charge. Well, actually, it also includes software for phones or anything like that, or iPod applications that are free. But let's not get into that because I won't really be reviewing anything except for computer stuff. There's also shareware, which is, I guess, you could consider it a type of freeware, but it's software that is available free of charge, may be distributed for evaluation with the fee requested for additional features or a manual, etc. Which means, like, <coughs> if you have a program where you don't get all the features and you basically you're just downloading it to see what the program is like and it's free, but if you want the real, like, full program, you need to pay for it. But I won't be reviewing the full versions of any programs. I may be reviewing the free versions because they are essentially freeware and free to use, so why not? Everybody likes some free stuff. Okay, so now that you know what that is, I will just show you a few quick examples of types of freeware. Now, Firefox is freeware, which is the browser, the internet browser you see I'm using here right now, this year, Mozilla Firefox. I, this is my personal favorite, and over Internet Explorer, because it's very customizable and it's safer, and I may do a review of Firefox later, but as of right now, I only have one review that I have immediately planned out to do, which is of an application called Launchy. And... Google Chrome is another internet browser that you can download. These are just, I'm showing you quickly the sites where you can download them. Um, that's freeware. It's a free internet browser you can download and use. I actually have it. See, it's down here, but I don't use it as much as I use Firefox. And Skype is, you may have heard of these. These are, I'm, first I'm telling you a few more common ones that you've heard about. Like, uh, this is Skype. It's just basically a video calling service. You can call anyone for free and talk to them with voice and you can see them on webcam with video. And it's free. They provide it for you for free. And there is there are plenty of websites like this, freeware games, download free games every day, where you can just go on and download all of these games you see here. As I'm scrolling down you see all these games. You can download all these for free and there's some really great games some now will be cheaper but I mean there's some games that are great games that are just free because I guess some people are just that nice and then I'll be showing you some programs that you may not have heard of such as Rocket Doc which is a great program it's uh, I use it actually see this is what this is up here I will review that in a later review and yeah, that's basically it. I'll be reviewing some things that you may have heard of and seen before, such as internet browsers like Firefox, Google, Chrome. I will be reviewing probably some things like Skype, that type of thing, because there's many different types of programs available like that. I don't know, I'll be reviewing things you probably never heard of that could make your computer usage a lot easier. Anyways, <clears throat> that's all for now, so subscribe, rate, favorite, whatever you want to do. And just remember, I'll be posting lots of videos of reviews for freeware, and you might want to subscribe, see what I review. You might find some interesting programs that will make your computing just a little bit easier. Anyways, that's all for now.